Hello everybody, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch, and today at Unite Berlin, Unity have released the uh, environmental assets for their project, Book of the Dead. Now, Book of the Dead, you can see it running in the background. It is a showcase of the new high-definition rendering pipeline functionality available in Blender. And as you can see, the fidelity is absolutely amazing. Well, they've made this download available today. It's on the Unity Asset Store. I will link to it at the end of this video, or below this video. Um, it is 2.4 gigabytes in size, uh, requires Unity 2018.2b or higher, so either the newest version or one older than that. Um, and one of the things to be very, very aware of, make sure you import this project into an empty 3D template. I screwed this up over and over again and it cost me hours of my life. Do not create um, a high detail or high def render pipeline project. Create a blank. 3D template project and then do the import otherwise it will fail miserably. Now this thing includes all of the various different assets required to make this um, to, that were used in the environments of this demo and they are released under actually I'm not sure what license this is under uh, but as you can see the results are incredibly good looking um, and it kind of is showcasing how Unity yeah, God, I don't want to get into a holy war over this, but they're definitely catching up uh, with uh, Unreal Engine for what graphics fidelity they're capable of. And this really does nicely showcase uh, what you can see. Now, what you're seeing in front of you is running real time in 1080p on my 1080 GTI uh, external GPU. Um, now, in the Unity editor, it struggled a bit when I had it set for the 4K PS4 resolutions. Uh, I understand, and here you can see right now we are actually in real time in the editor going through the um, the assets that are available. So this is basically what you download and um, are capable of playing around with. Whereas the earlier example we saw right there was the actual built and compiled executable. Again, the, the fidelity is absolutely staggering and the editor does a pretty good job of handling things. Now you watch there, I chunked out a little bit for a second. The frame rate is dropping off a little bit. And part of that is probably the fact that I'm running an eGPU as opposed to a dedicated internal GPU. And because of the fact that um, this is really kind of demanding on my machine. When you're running in the 4K made for PS4 Pro kind of modes, it does chug a bit. Now what we can see here is actually there is a scene available that showcases and demonstrates all the individual assets from this. So this is where it could be useful to you. If you are making a high detailed game project, you may be able to bring these individual assets out and use them in your game. Now I do need to look up to see exactly what um, license these are under. I'm not sure I've actually seen a license yet, so I'm gonna dig around a bit and see if I can find that. And once I know the license for sure, I will throw that in the comments down below in this video. But I definitely wanted to showcase this. This is a cool looking project. It does showcase just how uh, capable uh, Unity actually is for creating high fidelity graphics. And it, it's almost photoreal. It's, it's amazing how um, how well we've gone in this regard in such a short period of time. I remember like even a year or two ago, a lot of people would look at the Unity project and think, yeah, it doesn't look that good or it looks like a Unity game. Well, these new programmable pipelines are really changing that. This a high definition pipeline is just uh, staggeringly beautiful in what it can do. So um, yeah, these are all available for right now. Like I mentioned, they're on the asset store. Uh, it's a 2.4 gigabyte download. And once again, big time reminder, um, do be sure to bring this and clone this into an empty project or you are going to run into error. So that was by far and away the mistake I made. And also make sure that you have one of the most current versions of the beta. There are dependencies there or this will not run. All right, so that is the environmental assets from the Book of the Dead project. Uh, amazing what they're doing in real time. I'm, I'm curious to hear what you have to say. Uh, are you impressed with the graphic fidelity from the high definition pipeline for the Unity engine? Do you still think that Unreal is the, has the crown here? Do you think that... Um, you know, Unity has come a long ways, or do you think they still have a long way to go? All right, that's it for now. I'm interested in hearing what you think about it. I'll talk to you all later. Goodbye.